Hello everybody, Eric here with Mini Maximus, and um, I was just thinking that you know we got probably a little bit too much health for this character. Most of the time we uh, are just doing uh, hyper mode, so why bother with too much health? Uh, also, I think when we get power within, uh, it, the amount of comes off will relate to how much health we have, and I'm not sure if, if the blessed uh, weapon and resword uh, really does, bothers with the ratio. So. Anyway, I think there's I think we have too much health and I want to distribute the health to luck or endurance. All right. Okay, I should mention that uh, the re one of the reasons we had high health to start with was to do the skip and to be able to have some health to run around and not get killed by the Lothric castle enemies. It was actually very helpful in the early game and uh it just isn't as as useful now as the extra attack power. So it's, I think it's a good time to switch. The bosses are getting a little bit uh, um, bigger and tougher. Uh, one strategy is that you could use the extra health to buffer uh, you, and actually have a little bit of health so you can tank a few hits in hyper mode. But that's not what I'm interested in. I'd, I'd rather just not get hit at all and use the denial, okay? Okay, there's two ways that you can do this fight, guys. Uh, Using the bow was the first way I thought about hiring Cirrus and uh, using her as a distraction and just using the bow. Okay, so we'll see how that goes. Um, it does take a little bit longer uh, than if you just buff your weapon and go all go to town. That, that'll be the special treat to see later at the end of the video. So if you want to fast forward to that, be all, by all means go ahead and do that now. But I thought this was interesting. I thought it was fun to try and get the bow going and to see if I could peg out the different uh, red uh, red enemies. And it's working so far. Cirrus draws all the fire. It just leaves you free to headhunt. Okay. It does take a little bit of time and you will get uh, shot at uh, during the second, you know, the final phase where all the deacons get all buffed up. Alright. Uh, but I fast forwarded uh, through all the through that part where I got uh, shot at and stuff. It, just, it was just me healing and, and getting my uh, denial back up to parts. I did get hit a couple times there, okay? But we'll fast forward uh, to the final part in just a moment here. Yeah, so I got hit there. And I just had to heal and stuff. I reposition, stay behind the pillars, and we'll, and we'll see what happens here to finish it off. for a headshot to finish it off, eh? <laughs> so it does work. It just takes a little bit of time. Okay. But let's get to uh, the other way to do it. Okay, this is the fun part, guys. I put on the Karthus Rouge to see if the bleed things work. Um, we will get you know, really good luck damage uh, with the bleed, but... I don't know if I was actually hitting enough times in a row to build up bleed on any one enemy. I don't think so. So basically what we're doing here is going buffless, and this is still destroying this boss. Okay. You can see that one hit will just mow through whatever they have for health, so it really doesn't even matter how much more buff I put on. Um, one hit will just sail right through them. He did a thousand damage to that one guy. Um, and of course the final final melee with her didn't take very long regardless. Maybe it could have been a couple seconds faster, but uh, that's that for that boss. So that was a lot of fun. Let's just check out the stats though to see what we would have had had we put the uh, you know the made probably the dark buff on with this new respec character. Okay. So throw on the dark buff, which I think is the best, I don't know, I'm not sure with which each boss their weakness is, but this is giving us 708 now, so we have 40 luck, 23 dex, 15 faith as before, but we changed the, the, the health and put some endurance, and mostly the luck and the endurance is where I put the extra health stats, guys. Alright, thanks for watching.